My name is Luis Mendoza, Senior Director of Business Development at CSKeller. At CSKeller, we help our customers in their digital transformation to cloud and mobility. We do this through enabling their employees to gain secure access to any internet destination, as well as SaaS applications, and even to internal applications that are being migrated over to run on either a platform as a service environment or an infrastructure as a service environment. We do this across a large network of over 100 different data centers around the world, which enables the customers to implement local breakout capabilities without having the dependency on any particular specialized type of equipment at the branch office. So it's very seamless and very simple for customers to take advantage of this new architecture and enables them to take advantage of all of those applications running on the cloud. Our integration with Azure Active Directory has different steps onto it. First, we started by leveraging standard protocols like SAML that allows us to do authentication. Uh, so every time a user needs to get authenticated on the cloud to access this type of security capabilities on both ends uh, for Zscaler and Azure AD, it creates a communication through this type of standard protocol. In addition to that, we have enabled um, another advanced protocol, which is called Scheme Tutorial. And this one enables companies to manage the life cycle associated with their employees and their ability to design, uh, define when employees can access certain type of applications and when the access management uh, changes. So that even if an employee decides to leave a company, then you can centralize from a Azure AD perspective, deprovision this user in near real time without having to go through multiple different management interfaces, which decreases human error and improves the security posture across the board. Our licensing model is very simple. We charge per user per month, and we enable customers to select what is the selection of features that they want to go with. And we enable them to start with a small set of capabilities, and then they can change that as they go. And the Azure AD side of the table, uh, all that is needed is Azure P1 level licensing. Okay.